wasn't good enough. Position in the back, draw them forward. That wouldn't work either because my guys, my guy doesn't have a pull staff. So if I if I if I draw him forward, I don't. My assassin's not strong enough to kill him. She doesn't have a, a frantic. It's not like my my assassin is like stacked. My assassin is not stacked for where we were. So I had to kind of use. Um, if, if if it was stacked, then I would use that, but. I think it was more about disabling all of them, and then so my guys can go in and kill. Follow Big Bro's lead, and the victory is yours. My crawler at that point couldn't go in and like one shot stuff. Double Ogre. Follow Big Bro's lead, and the victory is yours. Oh, you know what? Something I realized. Since I items are so uh, dependent, like late game, in, in, in some of the comps. Did you guys ever think about? Cause the items that you pick up, this is something I, I like never talk about. But items that you pick up are are you guys already know this? It's based on your what your opponents have, right? And the build that they're going is usually the items tend to complement those builds, right? And since there were like, I think three mages in that lobby, that's why we, we mostly got mana items instead of like assassin items. Uh, carry items. I mean, that that's not always the case, but most of the time it's, it is the case. Got a pole staff. Uh, kind of debating on my my build. Still here. No idea. Evil knight. I can go either way. Pole staff or uh, cleave here. Yeah. So I mean, that could that could help you. Like thinking about that. Like sometimes in the game when you're you're using it. A certain comp and you're like oh if i get this item it's gonna secure me first place if i get this item it's gonna secure me top three right and you're basing those decisions on people dying right but if you're thinking about if you think about the people that are dying they might not even you if you they if they're all mages and you were like banking on these dps items to help you carry you through the game you might not not even get those because most of them are mages they're gonna give you mana items so that could help you make better decisions throughout the game is pretty much what I'm trying to say. Like sometimes when we're, we're waiting on like this a stick, and there's like four mages that are about to lose, and you're like, oh wait, why didn't I get a stick? People, three, four people just died. Well, they might not, might have not had a stick, because they didn't, they didn't prioritize sticks. I'm just saying, like that's just very, very outlier like example, but. Um, can I look at the comps here? I think it mages, though I didn't pick up the cleave here. We probably use the dragon. Like, so I guess we'll just do pulse.
There's already three assassins on board. I'm not really high rolling assassin, so since we're loose streaking, best play, best build to go when you're loose streaking, man. The mages are fucking feathered, so that was a pretty easy choice. I should probably put three mages in too, huh? Don't really need this guy. We either kill or we don't. When are there going to be new units added to the game? On the 29th, I believe. But yeah, what I said makes sense. It made sense, right? About the items. Hmm. Double Heaven Bomber? Maybe. Let's go no tanks, all DPS. I just want to get killed since I'm loose streaking, right? It's not about... I mean, I know I'm not, I'm not going to win these guys since they're, they're pretty strong builds right now. So I just want to push levels and get kills. And what are the best things to get kills with? Not Goblins, not Goblin bonus, not Mech bonus, but Double Heaven Bomber. That's why I picked that over to the other guy. And Venoms. Venoms can get kills. Lena can get kills. Right now we're still loose chicken. Can this hold though? It probably can. If I just put two Venoms in the front, it should be able to hold. One Venom per Golem. There you go. Come and have some radishes. Uh, no BKB. Got another mana. Oh, maybe. Shit. Let's wait on that. So round ten. Yeah, looks good. I got Storm Shaman too. Storm Shaman gonna do well with. I guess we don't need these anymore. Okay, it is Star Shot do well with three mages? Or should I just keep Fortune Teller? I don't think I should I don't know, we'll see. See if I go on loose streak or win streak. We don't know yet. Oh, we're gonna lose here. Too many two stars for me to kill. Shaman got ult. Tor got ult. Oh maybe we can kill. Okay, I need one more ult from yeah. They're killing- I feel like they're killing enough units for me not to use- Not to use, uh, Priest. It's not too bad. EKB. Maelstrom? Nah, I'll probably just save that. Grim touch. Now nah, we're chilling. No rush, man. Gonna need a lot of money here. Oh, terrible. Water spear OP. There's really nothing I can do about that. That's just a fat rip. That's why water spear is so good, man.
Alright, no rush. How many check how many mages again? Oh, top guy's a mage, but I do have I mean he's he beat me. But I got tort over him. If he never finds another tort, then uh, I could potentially beat him later. But not right now, not can't really do anything right now. Oh, the wolves came out. Dang it, Venom ulti on... On Swordsman. Oh, I actually killed him. Cool, 40. Dragons. One, two, three. Is it, is it time? I think I should go seven. I don't want to stay down here for too long. We did win that round. But do I really get value by putting in another one? And leaving source in? It's decent. Not too bad. Makes sense about items, there is. And do you feel like the pace of the game could slow down or speed up again? Do you feel like uh, it'll permanently keep around this pace, leveling? Do you feel like item nerfing, buffing? Okay, that's a lot of, lot of questions in one paragraph there. So let me try to answer that with one sentence I don't know <laughs> okay um feels like the pace I think the pace is fine right now I think the pace is the the current pace right now for the game is good I think it's healthy for the game to for it to be fast because when it's slow, uh, all people do is just sit to 50 and roll down, right? But right now, right now it's good. Six mages? Oh yeah, I should probably do that, huh? Alright, one sec. Venoms are good here. Uh, for uh, In terms of items... Yeah, I, I think some items do need... Oh, not necessarily a nerf. I think they need to be moved around. Because some items are too OP early and some items are not that great late game. Someone mentioned last time, I think it was Tuggers? It was either, I think it was Tuggers that said that the, uh, the timing of certain items is very important because mages don't really spike till later, so anti-maga cloaks are pretty shit early game, right? So that's why I think that's an issue there. If you if you really want to think about something with um, think about something with uh, with balancing items. Six mages. I think I'm gonna leave this for this round. Just try to get some kills, and I'll go six mages next round. Let's see if I can sell an ogre here. Oh, he's got the BKB on the. Um, Oh, nice. Good kills. Okay. I okay. I also think the small the small cleave with pure damage is is kind of crazy. I I think that one doesn't need pure damage. I think the big one deserves it because it's hard to get. I think the small one with pure da uh, pure damage on it makes assassin or like anyone that uses cleave so broken. They are just like make it. They just make them a lot stronger than what they they really are. Cause they're a they. The fact that they're able to beat counter builds because they they have pure damage is so insane to me. They can do a late game, that's totally fine, right? But sometimes they're beating them like mid game because of that because of that item. So I don't know. I wouldn't I wouldn't mind if L little cleave if they took away 
pure damage from Little Clave. The future looks My hair looks time. Time oh, the heck? Did I just get another pulse there? I need it. Can we roll a little bit? I mean, I skipped out on the BKB because I wanted it to pulse, but we'll get it next time, I guess. Nice. Ripping still. I still sign here. Yeah, I need to roll down a lot more to hold right now. I don't want to make the same mistake I did earlier today by not by not rolling down harder by hitting my twos first so I could hold these. Since I got Tor right there. Look at mages are broken. You have one star, you almost win. Nah, yeah. They're... But but like I said, it's not it's not the mages, it's the items. Try try doing this without pulse stats, see what happens. I got pulse stats, so I might not need... Or maybe I do. I just want to hit that tour, man. Oh gosh. That's definitely not enough to hold, dude. Tor or uh, Shaman? I need one of them to hit two star, man. Yeah, cleave one. Cleave one is definitely needs some kind of fixing, whether it moved around or the fact that every game you go into this and you're like, oh yeah, if I don't have cleave, I don't win this game. If I don't have cleave, I don't go certain builds. Like, and that that's so true for so many builds. Pull staff, it's only it's honestly only true for mages, right? So if anything, cleave is definitely more broken than than pull staff. Think about it that way. My name is Radish Elf. So, uh, boss. Seriously. I got a BKB. I still need a fucking roll here, man. Alright, big upgrades. Got thunder. Don't need the Lena. Bought next to Lena for no reason. Nice. Now you can save up. Come and have some radishes. It'll be fine. This one for DK. <clears throat> Which item gives cleave? Shit, I don't even know what it's called. The fuck is it called? <laughs> I've been calling it cleave my whole life. Little, little cleave and big cleave. Uh, what what is it called, guys? Shadow Edge and Axe of Fury. It's good for melee, melee attack builds, yeah. But not, but not only that. 
It's not just the melee, it's that pure damage. It's that pure damage that makes armor com completely irrelevant. Without that, without that item, there's no way assassin will be able to be warriors or knights. Did I really buy this warwood? I don't even remember. Oh, I did because of the uh, because of the unicorn. <clears throat> I got a PT this game. I got BKB, so I feel like I'm not as worried. This shaman doesn't even have full staff. I'm more more worried about the other uh, BKB comps. Venom needs a ulti here. Oh, okay, Lena's still alive. Very nice. Shadow Edge is the reason you never go. There you go. That's that's a fucking good. Yeah, that's good reason to nerf. That item, so that people can actually start playing Berserker again. That's a that's a really good reason. What if Cleave did ma uh, physical damage? I'd I'd be fine with that. Yeah, I mean that'd be a great nerf to it. Yeah. But I I wonder if that's too big of a nerf. So I don't know, cause I'm not. I, you know, I mean, they gotta, they gotta test it out themselves. Oh shit, this guy looks hella strong. He's at the bottom though. Who's gonna knock him out? Looks like he has so many threes. Nice, got a second blast in there. Good shit. Didn't lose too much damage. I mean, HP. Battlefield needs to keep here, yeah, for sure. That I agree with. Not easy, not easy to get that item, and plus sometimes you have to pick another item over that item, so there's decision making involved in that process. There, I'll probably just wait, wait for this, push nine, and then see what who will use the egg on. I don't know if I want to take out Venom yet. Probably just keep DK and Venom. I don't think I'm gonna use this guy unless um actually hits like Dark Spirit man. Maybe Kumka, I guess. Let's just maybe check out top guy here. He doesn't have full staff. Yeah, his mages are small. He's pushing ten. I think that's our, our little window will beat him, because right now he's still really weak. But if we just let him like get more items, it's gonna be a problem. However, hmm. okay, yay! Oh, let's roll a little bit more because I don't know if I'm supposed to be using probably DK though. There, there you go. Oh <laughs> my, my formation's all fucked up. Halber, I feel like we need. Yeah, we're gonna need Halber. Otherwise, I'm gonna have problems against the night guy too. Jackal mask. I mean, I had top three secured, at least. Oh. Don't do that again. Don't do that again. 
I just go tap for Scar now. And I, I should be good against Mage with it. Maelstrom, I think right now it's more important to lock him down. Most of my damage come from mages and not really the D, uh, DK DPS. So as long as we lock we lock certain certain units down, we can blow them up. I mean, I've, I've played nine mages before and it's never worth going. And the only thing that I think is gonna, the only change that I think it's gonna make nine mages worth going is that if nine mages can destroy uh, four marines. It, it doesn't have to like obliterate them, but it has to like look like it has a chance to beat them. Because right now it has no chance of being four marines. It just makes no sense to me. What's the point of having nine nine mages? Know what I mean? My name is Radish Elf. And I, I don't think it'd be that bad making it OP versus four marines because it's hard to get nine mages and it's also easy for someone to drop four marines. That's why I think it's a fair trade. Good addition to the game. Makes it more balanced. Maybe I got a PT for top now. Oh, he's got, yeah, he's got it. He's got it. Don't want to sleep on him, man. We, we, we've been sleeping. All right, guy. Hopefully, hopefully. Oh, no. My shaman went off, though, so that's good. And my, my good thing my Totala has BKB, so that helps, too. But uh, I really had to PT there. That w I would destroy him if I if I PT'd there. I just gotta put Venom on the right. Okay. Wait. Oh my gosh, dude, that scared me. I thought I combined frantic. Uh, PT just means throwing these units on away from, well, getting your lineup to be Venom and Winter Wyvern, front and last units, so that the um, Shaman could target these units instead of my main lineup on the left side. They, they really wanted me to make the Frantic on this dude, man. They really want me to do it. Baiting me. See if we need um If they're if they're not in anywhere close to four marines, I don't really have to pick up the dev. If they're if they're close to four marines, then I, I look into the dev, but th at this point, I don't think it's necessary. Look at all that attack. If only I can combine the two ray shard, you used to be able to, now you can't. But they'll they'll combine to something once I get once I get the hammers. No shield? Uh oh. like no shield, we have potential. Someone take him out, please. Yay! Peace. Thank you, Warrior. Warrior did my dirty work. Now I just gotta be- I just focus on being the mage because he has more HP, so... Hmm... If I save this... Make sure this guy's using the items. Ah, uh, DK Dave in turn. Sorry, man. Where am I, dude? That's PT right there. Shaman ulted the right side. For those who don't know. It's 
So we play against Mage? Should I just make HP? I don't think Halberd is going to do shit, huh? Oh, let's, well, let's do, let's do a big one. I don't know. I was thinking about it. Armor. Armor is not going to do anything either. But I don't know. We should be able to beat him. Oh, no. PT didn't work there. So sometimes it doesn't work. But most of the time it will work. He said his shaman went on my dude, my units. DK. You know what? If I just get combine this into a maelstrom or something to make something, or maybe I can just make these items. There you go. I have an extra space. Maybe put a BKB on this guy, and no, I should be good. He's gonna play. Is he gonna play on the right side? I can blow him up with DK here. Yeah, it just, it just needs it just needs HP. I think that's what I'm gonna try to do. Give HP or BKB. Look at that attack speed though. It's fucking beautiful. There you go. It's a lot better. Wall probably not necessary. Yeah, I think the shaman should go. Alright, here's good. Just don't sleep on his positioning. Armor on spirit? Armor is not gonna do anything, dude. Alright, I just wait for a good item. There, BKB and DK. BKB, DK. And there we go. Um, do I want big Mysterio staff? He has. I feel like we want HP over the Mysterio staff. Oh, actually, I. Oh, fuck, I had a refresher. Oh, okay, never mind. The refresher would have been better. My bad. I just had to wait for another one. I did not have a refresher. Yeah. Just trying to get HP so he can live through the blast. And I can blow him up afterwards. Alright, DK's still doing work. I right, they still live. There you go. Slow and steady. Um, let me see. There's one slot left. So one of them for male. For Molnir. And then what the fuck am I going to do with the other one? Attack speed. Hmm. Don't sleep on his positioning. So he's not doing PT. Oh, he's doing wall now. I mean, trying to clump all my dudes up. I don't think wall is better than PT, man. Cause I mean, if if my DK is on the right, then he's just pretty much clumping everything for my DK to kill. I, I can understand maybe we try to like wall the, the other side, but wall this side, I don't know. I can maybe drop this guy for Siren, so I'm gonna do that. Tsunami. Not until they're two star though, so I'll just wait. Don't sleep on his positioning, still the same. Wait, yo, my Tortalo Blast didn't go through there because of the wall. Oh, maybe I got Tortalo the right. I got Tort the right. Oh shit, what'd I do? Marine? Oh, I 
And take this car out. I try this. Can't blow me up. So yeah, but I got BKV, so I should play on the same side. There we go. And now with uh, HP and and Marine, he should not be able to kill me. Try that. As long as we play same side here, it shouldn't be uh, it shouldn't be a problem. Maybe I can try to PT. I'm still trying to PT this side, right? Even though Siren is on this side. Or should I just frontline Siren and get PT on here? Because this guy BKB, BKB, went to Wyvern. I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter. If it's on, if this side, the Storm Shaman gets it. If it's on the other side, then the other guy gets it. So I guess it doesn't really matter. I, mean, I don't see him re repositioning at all. He should be trying to reposition somehow. I don't... I don't think his positioning right now. He's just letting, letting my DK get too much value. Maybe get pull staff on the siren. Follow Big Bro's lead, and the victory is yours. Oh, big BKB. I I feel like that's more important. Big BKB on um, DK is more important than refresher. This guy is stacked. He's stacked to kill, man. <laughs> is someone afraid of the dog? Don't sleep on him, though. Wait. Oh, fuck. He switched. He switched. I slept on him. I slept on his, his shit. Uh oh, that's not good. DK's a boss, though. DK's a fucking boss, though. Doesn't fucking matter. It's too late. I think he had to try to take me out earlier, and now at this point it's, it's kind of rough. But hey, that, he didn't take damage that round, so... That was good, I guess. I don't think we need this. I don't know why I'm even trying to pick that up. I'll switch on him last minute. He's watching me right now. Oh no, the tsunami! I fucked, I fucked up on tsunami. <laughs> My little tsunami, poor tsunami in that little corner. <laughs> Whoops. I just gotta be on the same side. Little tsunami in the corner there, trying to protect him. Maybe use this. Can finish him now? Before he gets too strong. There can be only one true master of thunder. It's gonna be on the right. Oh, I'm lagging, I'm lagging. Shit. I don't got DK over. I lagged a little bit there. I right, tsunami got ult though. That's still good. DKB. GG's. Pretty much when I got the tsunami and siren, it was over. Sorry, nothing you can do. Maybe the maybe that armor item wasn't so bad. I mean, not the uh, actually not the armor the the HP item kept my guy alive, dude. They couldn't he couldn't blow through it, with, especially with two marines. Where is it? I threw it on Shaman. How much is this? Plus 600? I'm trying to read that. Is it how much? 600 HP? 